Hey! Oh man, this place how sweet, how sweet, how sweet, oh no, why do you sing? I want, I want to vlogs in one week like what do I win <laughs> already this is crazy that we were like gone for like three hours so we recognize that we left it at least we had a bottle we in, in the car or else we would have been screwed yeah. we were in the middle of nowhere arizona lucky we even had service we're lucky no one stole it we're lucky for instagram some random stranger uh, went and got our diaper bag we left it while we made a pit stop at cedar city and then she sent it back to us and she wouldn't go get it What's Thanks it say? for giving me a chance to serve. Happy day. Excellent, Aww. Excellent, Jackie Webb. Well, Jackie Webb, you're the best. You're the best, Jackie. Hey, Kristen. Find your flashlight. <laughs>
I think it's your princess costume. Yeah. Whoa, whoa. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Okay, grab it out. Oh, did they not put it in there? We'll paint your face and give you fangs and blood. No, uh, werewolves no red blood. No oh. Blood. We'll give you a brown nose. Mm -hmm. Maybe some, some dirt on your face. I like your go-go boots. Just kidding. <laughs> what are you painting, Mercy? Yellow. We're painting everything. <laughs> My costume is here. <laughs> Today's a literature day at school. They are doing a parade and they have to dress up as someone from a book and they have to bring the book. And Miss Gracie chose Miss Viola Swap. Gracie, you ready? You excited? All right, here we go. <laughs> Yep. All right, grand reveal. Ta -da -da. Let me go look in the mirror. Okay. Ah! <laughs> Black hair, Gracie. Here's our final look. We got our red cheek and our mole. And your striped socks. Yeah, you look good. And guess what? She's one month old today, and they're playing her song in the store. Elton John, your song. Because all of our kids have their own song that we sing. Oh, yeah, that's a good book. And they're playing hers. It's her month birthday. You're handsome. I love you. You excited to wear your costume tonight? Yeah. What are you going to dress up as? Werewolf. Wow. You. So I'm just explaining which one's the best one. Well, you look hot. Christmas Fulton, I'm in the center of God gave you three West Place here and we'll get two books. You look totally awesome. I can't see you. Look at you with those balloons. <laughs> those are decorations. Never decorated for a trunk or treat before in our existence. Wait, let's tuck that up so we can't see the back. All right, this is what we came up with. This is from Gracie's unicorn birthday. This is from our tablecloth. And courtesy of Walmart, the balloons. What? Really? He's been by himself, secret, like very quietly. 
He probably is like 10 times down the row of cars. And he's going by himself like super sly. <laughs> the boys counting their candy. <laughs> Good morning. So we have soccer today, right? And then we're gonna go to the zoo. Yeah, I take a cheesy. Yeah. I have a take a Gracie's soccer game, I unconsciously raised the roof. Zero thought went into it, it just happened. When was the last time you raised the roof, babe? I don't know if I ever have. Are you joking? You wanna give me a little, do it. You're doing it wrong. Yeah, don't you feel better? I feel like if we raised the roof a little more, we'd feel better about a lot of things. Mm -hmm. Gave us a free ticket. Nice. That was so nice of them. Free ticket. There you go. Yeah, Good people exist. She's gonna sleep through the whole thing. Mercy. Mercy. We've been here for an hour. And we're just now getting in. That's cool. Right here. An hour. <laughs> oh, happy day! Basically, this whole thing is lines. Because <laughs> now we're in, but now we're in another line to do anything. Like a witch. Gracie is sick, so we're taking the babe to church to get away from sick Gracie. Look at her cute little outfit. All right, you ready? Decorations. Thanks for coming with me. I know the Halloween decorations are gone, huh? You look very handsome. 
It's Mercy's first time to church. You ready, baby? Very beautiful. Oh yeah. Slowly catching up. I'll get into this week's message and montage. I'll start the music. See you so soon. I'm on a roll here. Like you, I also know what it feels like to have nothing to show for your efforts. I also know what it feels like to wonder, to doubt, to struggle, to sink, to feel judged, abandoned, unwanted, unworthy, tried, tired, and alone. Like you, I also know how hard it is to keep going sometimes, where we feel as if we are hanging on by our fingertips when we're being pulled by our ankles in the opposite direction. Losing our voice, losing hope, losing strength, forcing ourselves to use this faith we don't know if we have or not. But I also know how worth it and possible it is to keep going, to see it through. Yeah, it takes work, but all things do. The trick to losing weight is work. The trick to getting good grades, work. The trick to getting a real testimony, work. The trick to keeping a testimony, work. <laughs> but can we think of anything more important than endless life and eternal bliss? We have to give this a real go at it, every day. We have to continuously choose him over the fleeting things of the world. We have to stay focused because we are meant for something so much greater than this. So much greater than the here and now. Greater than the worldly happiness that isn't even a sliver of the godly. Let's make taking care of ourselves and our souls a priority. Make God a priority. This gospel, it's not our last option. It's our only option. Because this isn't just wishful thinking. It's real.